Goe from Gambia, we have Goe from Senegal, we have Goe from Mali. But um, definitely from my own point of view, I guess um, Goe from the Gambia is the best. Yeah, because even people do come from Senegal to come and check, you know, to get our Goe, the Goe from Gambia. Even us, when we need it, it's, it's in short demand. You cannot get it. Definitely, it's in short quantity. Liban. This other one is called Liban. It is purposely for good luck. Some people will like to burn these things, but um, they might not have, um, maybe they are not with their wives, they are just single people and they want to burn this, they cannot, they cannot get fire, they cannot take their... Um, to go to go and collect fire, they might feel, feel very shy. So what I prefer that they will use the liquid type of um, perfume that we normally blend. It gives you the same odor. We have different types. If you want the one that smells like Gowe, we can mix it with you and give it to you. If you want the one that smells like um, Dubai Chugai, we can mix that type, of, that type also and give it to you, yes. How do we match incense and weather? During the raining season, I uh, prefer people to use um, the goe. We yeah, are the dry goe because the reason of using the dry goe is um, it's, it's, it stays longer in the house, and all this bad odor coming from the gutters, urine from animals around drainage system. When you light this day, at least it dries all that air, bad air away from the house. So dry goe is preferable. Apart from giving off scented smoke, there is a great connection between incense and traditional medicine. This gawa is already processed and is from Senegal. This particular gawa could be used for medicinal purposes. A lot of people normally say, if you burn it, um, it can drive Satan away far, no evil spirit in your house. It's good to burn anyway. This Barakanda is another type. It's used to drive away evil spirits, especially at night. The most appropriate time and how to burn incense should be of concern to women because they are the major users. Normally, people come to this place, different churai spots, and buy churai. And they go and listen and burn it. And the way they burn it, they will say, ah, the person that sold me this churai is not. The scent, the odor that is coming out is not pleasant. No, no, it's not, it's not our fault. It's the person's fault. It's the because it's the method in, in which you apply it. So what I'm advising people is whenever they want to burn this chugai, mm -hmm. instead of applying it directly to the red fire charcoal, mm -hmm. they just have to cover it with the ash and then apply it just on top of the ash and not too much. Just a bit of the chugai, you just apply it on top of the, the hot ash. So right now, this one is smoking. Yeah, this one has... As you can see, this is smoking. Why is it that it is smoking? This is the dry goe. Obviously, it has to smoke. But when you apply the goe salve or the soap, one, the one we blend with perfume, it reduces the smoke and the, it, the odor comes out very softly. Okay? And very slowly. Nice smell, even little long life. When you burn this thing in your house, definitely, the, the odor, it changes. Different odor, the sweat, heat, it removes different bad odor from your house. And you know, if your husband comes from work and meets, you know, your, your, your churai pot is this thing with fire and you just put a split of this thing in it, definitely you can, you can, you can remove all bad, you know, mood from him and whatsoever, and odor whatsoever from the room. Some people do prepare food in their house, and it will not be pleasant if your husband comes from work and the house is just smelling these plazas whatsoever. So it's good after preparation of food. Gage, yeah, yeah gaja, dry fish, everything smelling in the house. It feels very bad. So when you burn this thing, definitely, you can be very happy in the home. Okay. A nice and pleasant environment could be a cornerstone to the long-term development of a happy family. So try the best incenses in town.